Welcome to Transport Fever 2. Today, we're going to be moving our transport company from Europe all the way to Brisbane, Australia. Welcome to Brisbane, Australia. It is June 14, 1859. It's nearly 1860 in Brisbane, Australia. This is what Brisbane, Australia looks like in 1859. Wow, looks very, very old. Wow, this is crazy. Wow, look how old the buildings are. Oh, wow, wow, wow. Wow, wow, these are all commercial buildings, by the way, too. How cool is this? Wow, that is absolutely crazy. Oh, my. And we're going to build the best transport infrastructure here in Brisbane, Australia. From where I live in Sydney, it is up north to Brisbane. And we're going to come to here. If you didn't check out our last series of Transport Fever 2, we were doing a European-style map. Go check out our European series where we built the best infrastructure in Europe. But I think we're going to do something even better here in Australia. We're going to be using American vehicles, not European vehicles, so everything's going to be like in the American type style vehicles. That's what I'm thinking, guys. If you want to see more Transport Fever 2 Season 2, make sure you go down below and smash a like on the video. Can we get about 5 likes on this video? That would be greatly appreciated. And if you are new here, guys, make sure you go down below and smash that red subscribe button down below so you can get notified when we post brand new videos because they do go live every Tuesday, Thursday, Saturday, Sunday at 12 12 a.m. Australian East Stand Time. Guys, comment down below. Did you see my first video of Airport CEO on Tuesday at 12 a.m.? Comment down below. Tell me if you saw my first episode of Airport CEO Season 3. Wow, Season 3 already. We're recreating Sydney Airport Australia, which is down south from Brisbane, which is super cool. We're in Australia this week. In Australia, we're in... We're, I have no idea what I'm saying. We're in Australia this week. We need to have a look, though, where we're going to make our first look. Lines. It's all about the first lines now. Now, Brisbane would be cool to look at because we can do fuel and all that. We've got a uh, oil well here. We can then manufacture oil over to here and we can make fuel and send it to Brisbane. That could be really good to see. I'm just going to make sure that my audio for um, the music in the background is not too loud. I'm <laughs> just making sure very quick. All right, we can look at what we got. I do would like to look at Brisbane though. Brisbane could be cool to look at. Anything else around? around Brisbane we could look at. We could look at here. This could be a really good loop here. We've got the farm here. Now, I know the farm isn't really the best starting point. It's not really the best way to start a series, but we do have a farm here. We've actually got a few farms around here. Northgate could be really good. We could get the farm. How much is this farm producing? 200. So, we could get, you know, 200 material from here all the way to the factory here and then out to Northgate. That could be one line we could set up. And uh, what else do we got out here? We've got wood. Okay, we do have some wood here. We can make some wooden planks. That could be cool. All right, nothing really there. What does this town need? Bricks and bread. Nothing really there. That nudgy needs bread too. We've got a farm, farm. Yeah, see, really, this Northgate food processing plant would have to supply Northgate. Like, nearly all of these uh, countries around here, all these cities, towns, small towns. I don't know why I said cities, because they're not really cities. They're all small towns. I don't know why I said that. Let's have a look around. Um, We're going to need stone to make bricks. No. No, we don't really have anything around here. We can't make fuel here. Will Wilston? Will Will Wilston? No, can't do bricks. No. What about all the way out here at Dara? No, we can't work out there. Actually, I just found the one of the perfect lines here. We might set up a bread line, but I think this line here looks pretty cool. Now we got Camp Hill. We can look at, but we got Cat Cat Crane Cat Cat Crane 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 Dow Crane Dow. Thank you. Karen, Karendale, that's it That's it, I'm trying to figure out my words I'm trying to figure out my words, but we got Construction materials here, producing 100 there, and how much is this Quarry doing? 400 and 400 here, so from this quarry, we could Take it to here, and then take it to Karendale That could be a really good line, I think I'm going to get set up straight on that Now we are using two mods in this series And we're using cash flow, which if I hover Over it, you can see income, maintenance, and Interest, so that's one, and also There'll be line colouring, so there's line 
on automated uh, line coloring. That is also another thing that I've got installed too. I do would like to maybe install some Australian like type vehicles and all that. Comment down below if you would like to see some mods uh, of like some Australian vehicles in this series. Comment down below what you think and if you've got a link to maybe some of the mods that you might be interested for us to play in this series, leave a comment down below. Let me know what mod it is and I'll take a look at it. But we are going to set up our very first line here at the quarry right in here. So we're not going to buy so much time because we've played this game before and we kind of all know how to play this game. Well, um, <laughs> oh yeah, Aiden's like, yeah, yeah, we all know how to play this game, don't we? Yeah, we all know how to play this game. I think Aiden's like forgotten, it, you know, how to play the game. <laughs> oh my God. Let's connect this up. We've got to have to connect this up here, but I think it might be first to get our street in here. Small country road. There we go. Uh, do we want to put a curve on here? We we'll put a nice little curve on here. There we go. And we've got to connect it up over here somehow. There we go. A nice road in here. Wow, this game music is so loud. Let me fix this up quickly. Okay, the game music sounds much better in my ears now. It sounds much better. It was so loud in my ears. I could not believe it. I couldn't even think to myself. Anyway, guys, this video is actually sponsored by Coca-Cola. No, it's not Coca-Cola. It's not sponsored by Coca-Cola. You know, the day I can actually say this video is actually sponsored by oh my god that the day that actually happens that'd be unreal to see that day actually happen but this video is not sponsored by anyone it's actually sponsored by me so if you want you should go and subscribe so you get notified when we post new videos that's why this channel is actually sponsored by by myself and not sponsored by anyone else <laughs> oh guys what do you reckon the day that happens when i can get sponsored get sponsorship wow that day that that happens that'd be unreal. Anyway, put another truck stop in here now. We need to put a truck stop in here now. We've got to make sure, though, we place a stop next to all of our commercial industrial area. So, in terms of in here, that could be alright. I might try and keep it to the towards the end of the street. That might be better. Anyway, there we go. There's our first loop installed. That is actually a quite an easy loop to do. Alright, let's jump into here now. We're going to go to Road Depot and I think we'll keep it closer to the actual town. So, we'll put our uh, road depot in over here somewhere. We'll try and turn this around so it looks very pretty. Uh, there we go. Right there. There we go. That should be all okay. Alright, time to create a new line. So, what's the line going to be called? I have no idea. I think we're just going to call it this town name, I think. Or actually, we can just say rock to, to brick. <laughs> rock to brick. And then we'll in brackets, we will put in the actual town name. There we go. Alright, so the two lines are set up. Now, let's set up the first item. I don't want to create more lines if possible. So we're going to go from our brick, I mean our stone to brick. That will be the first loop and we'll make sure this goes on number two. Uh, let's have a look. Make sure this is correct. Yes, you are on number two. And then from brick we'll go from add station, from brick to town. There we go. Perfect. Now, on terms of those loops, I want to make sure when it comes to into this town here, I want a full load if any. And then from the actual rock i think it's uh one let's uh full load if any that's what i'd prefer and honestly we should also maybe configure some of these times our max stop time over at the south is let's say 80 seconds and then we go <laughs> 80 seconds then we go in terms of the crescent there should be no stop time there in terms of the max you're picking up you gotta wait let's say two minutes no, 150 seconds you've got to wait for. All right, that just means what we're doing now, guys, is we're just trying to get all of our horses to keep going because horses are going to be super slow. I'm not looking forward to it, guys. I am not looking forward to it. All right, we need to purchase some vehicles now. Well, why did I say vehicles, right? We can't purchase any vehicles. We can only get an American horse to drown, car drown, yeah. We're going to drown a horse, guys. How cruel am I? <laughs> we're going to get a horse, horse carriage, right? That can only go 18 kilometers and only carries four things. That's like one, two, three, and four. Four things. Oh, God. That's crazy, isn't it ever? Oh, my. All right, but seven years. It's not going to last long, will it? Well, we let's get about 10 vehicles on this line. It's going to cost us $238,000, and that will be on the rock to the brick line. And then what we'll do is we'll purchase another four vehicles for the time being. Four vehicles. There we go. And we'll chuck that onto the rock. 
No, brick to the town. There we go. There we, there, there we go. There we go. Is that, what, the, what the hell are you talking about, eh? But there we go. Brick is starting to come out. You should actually find that we'll actually make a hell of a lot more money off brick than actually bread. Now, I can't believe it, guys. In our first series of Transport Fever 2, we did bread. So it'll be interesting now to see how much money we can make off bricks or construction material. That would be interesting to see how much we can make off that. But look at all our horses. Look at all our horses, horses. And speed up, please. Thank you very much. There's all of our horsey horses. There we go. Oh, my. Check them out. Wow. They're so slow. 18 kilometers. I can walk faster than 18 kilometers, guys. You know that? I can walk eight faster than 18 kilometers. Smash a like on the video if you do agree with that. But I think I can walk faster than 18 kilometers. Man, horses are so slow. Jeez. Oh, my. All right. So, I think let's... What we should do now is also set up another line over to here at Bowen Hills. Now, that's over here where... I swear there was another town that I was going to look at. Uh, uh, not there. Was that Northgate? Was it Northgate I was going to look at? Nudgy. Uh, from there to there. Northgate. We've got... We can actually set up a line here. This could be a really good line to look at. Right in here. 200. Okay. This could be a really good line in here. So let's jump, chuck in one of these. So this has got a double. So let's chuck in... Whoopsie daisy. Let's uh, spin this around. And let's make sure that's full colored. We want to make sure it's a nice deep white. If it's not a deep white, then we might have some issues. <laughs> we may have some issues. <laughs> All right, folks. Now we're going to chuck in our other truck stop over here. Making sure that's nice and close to the farm. There we go. There we go. Looking sexy. Bingo. And let's get in our truck stop over to here. And we need to deliver bread to all of our folks over here at Bowen Hills. There we go. Alright. Time to get in a few new lines. We're going to go from the farm to the bread. That'll be the first line. And then we'll go new line from the bread to the town. I think. Let's uh, relabel all this. And let's get a truck stop in. Alright. Two lines have been remodeled. I don't know why I said remodeled. They've been renamed. Now it's time to get a nice road depot in now. Alrighty. So let's uh, turn this around. We're going to put you in about in here somewhere. Looking nice and beautiful. Right there. There we go. Alright. Let's buy some vehicles now. I think let's go for 10. Not 0 Aiden. Not 190. What's going on Aiden? You need to uh, behave yourself please. Thank you. Let's buy 10 on there. Shut that all on the farm one line and then we'll buy another what do you reckon guys what do you reckon we'll buy another four vehicles and we'll chuck that on the uh bread to bowen hills there we go so all of our horses are coming out now and i want to place the actual our main building let's repay our loan off i think that's the first thing we'll do ooh, 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 ooh. first thing we'll do is we'll pay our loan off so we're not paying interest and i want to build our our um what do you call it <laughs> our main a building you know where are we gonna be placed and i think right in here just overlooking i think overlooking the shoreline overlooking the river right in the corner i think right in the corner we're gonna spin this around like so i think we might come up here a little bit actually and there we go three thousand dollars later we've got our old shakini john gamer transport hey 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 this is called a AP technology is not. This is not software, and Caden. This is AP transport. <laughs> AP Aussie Aussie transport. There we go. It is legit now, guys. It's AP Aussie transport. Aussie AP transport. Actually, that sounds even better. What do you guys reckon? Aussie AP transport. That sounds absolutely better. Yeah. Aussie AP Transport here to assist now. There we go. This is our company based in Brisbane. Now, we're going to have to start supplying Brisbane with a certain things, but let's have a look. In terms of bread, we've got enough wheat. Good to see. We've got a lot of wheat coming in. I'm going to speed the game up to get all of our horses and carriages to speed up because they're super duper slow. They're super slow. Look at the intersection here, man. That's absolutely crazy. Crazy, crazy, crazy. All right. Uh, we're not manufacturing anything just yet. Nothing yet. Not dropping anything off. You don't have anything on you? Nope. <laughs> you have anything on you? Nope. <laughs> hey, 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 hey. 
All right, I think you are the first person to load up on some material there. It's a shame we can only deliver four. Yeah, that's a shame. Anyway, let's uh, come over to here to um, <laughs> Gorindale. Gorindale, over to here. I think you're you're the one. No, I'm in the wrong space. Oh, e -A -E -U -E -A -A. There we go. How much stone do we have? We are doing pretty well. 100, 2% transport. Cool to see. And we're making some money. Positive cash flow. What's our cash flow like? Income, 18,000. Right, what are you waiting for? Bricks. Yeah, okay, 2,000. Now, I don't want you to manage vehicle, okay? So I think in terms of that line, let's come into that line, actually. Uh, I think it's lines. It's rock to brick. When it gets to the brick station, I think, brick. Yeah, so the Cardin North. Is that right? Is that right, Cardin North? Yeah. So why should we wait three minutes? 10 seconds max. You come in, you drop off, you piss off. Basically, not trying to be rude, but that's honestly what we need you to do is you come in, you drop your stuff off, and you go. Go away. Go and collect some more because it's going to take you, like, forever to, like, get me some material because, you know, we're talking about horses here. You see, guys? We're talking about horses. Look how slow they are. Like, come on. Ah, oh, nice to see. 27 material. Good to see. Now, we are delivering some. Oh, what are you over here? No, you don't. Uh, no. Uh, yep. Uh, you deliver our first lot of bricks. I swear we have another awesome carriage over here. No, you just delivered bricks. Okay. How much money are we making over here? Let's wait for our horse and carriage to come in. There it is. There he is. Doing a great job. Look at those horses. I wish I could run that fast. It, excuse me. It doesn't look like they're running 18 kilometers an hour. It's very, very fast. You know what I mean? Da, 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 da. <laughs> oh, yeah. They are building. Welcome. 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 <laughs> I'm sorry, guys. Why are they so slow? Oh, five kilometers. Hello. Hello. Where you go? Oh, hello. Whee! It's like a roller coaster. Yay. Oh, we're here. How much money do we make? $5,800. Good to see. So now if we have a look, our line's making us money. If we go from high to low, our rock to bricks making us $50,000. Our farm is making us $40,000. And we're making just five and $2,000 just off our material, sending it to the actual company. Collect company. Hayden. Seriously? Company? Company? Out of all the words you had to say, company? Ah. Oh. Okay, but that's all right. We're doing all right. Brisbane's too. Now, where's the most popular city? Brisbane. Brisbane has the most most in there. Okay. And in terms of cargo, in terms of size, in terms of cargo, we are supplying, aren't we? So the biggest city size. So we're supplying Carindale with stuff. So that, that's pretty good. And we're also supplying someone else with stuff. I can't see it, but oh well. We're doing pretty good. As you can see, it's doing pretty damn well. It's taking time to do things. But that is all okay. Another $4,000 made there of transporting those, uh, those, those goods. It might be interesting to see if we should increase our transport infrastructure maybe. So ever so slightly. We've got uh, this line coming into here. This could be good. Uh, this has 200 that has 200. So we could really see, I think, a train line coming into here, I, I would see. Uh, we could easily get a train line coming back into the farm here and then splitting the material to go to here and here. Split to the those two material up. And then from there, we kind of need to get bricks out there too. So we'd have to think about, um, you know, does Brisbane, Bowen Hills become like a hotspot for manufacturing maybe? You know, we can manufacture bricks over here at Ascot. You know, that could be really good. But where are you going to get all the material from? So that's the question. Where you get the material from? Well, material. You've got material here. We can train it into the farm or the brick construction area. But then you got to think, okay, well, what can I bring back? Well, I can't really bring anything back, can I? Well, this needs bread. Well, if you're based here, where are you going to get the bread from? You know, oh, okay, well, we've got a manufacturing area here. So we can take the farm up to here, take it north. Gate. We've got to take it to Nudgy. We've got to take it to here. We've got to take it to this. Like four towns right here in the vicinity right here. Four towns that need bread. A lot of towns with bread. <laughs> bread. Oh, God. Why Australia? Bread. Really? <laughs> really? We're doing pretty good. 
How's this place coming along? We're doing pretty well. Um, do we want to maybe increase a lot of our things? Oh, there we go. We're doing pretty well. I'm now considering, do we want to increase the number of infrastructure now we have in this area? So that's something I am considering. I am considering it. Yes, I am ever so slightly. Uh, 33 seconds frequency. So our frequency is good. Our frequency, however, however, you got to think about, you can say, okay, the frequency is good. Right, then now the material we're sending and, and delivering, which is good. Um, it's also based on how much money we're making. Um, this one here, we've got too much material here. So if we've got too much material over here, we probably want to get some more horses to come out here. In terms of here, we only got 28, right? So what I think I might do is, in terms of the brick line, brick to current or no, we need to go rock to brick. There we go. Okay, so we're going to go and buy another 10 vehicles, I think. We're going to buy another 10. There we go. Aiden, you're like, Aiden, you can't borrow it. You can't, you don't have enough money, Aiden. Thank you, thank you everyone for letting me know. I don't have enough money. So we are going to borrow a million dollars. I can't, there we go. We're going to borrow a million dollars. I don't know why it says three million dollars, but hey, let's um, come down here. We are going to buy some vehicles. And we're going to get 10 vehicles. Why are you not working? There we go. 10 vehicles. And we'll chuck that all on the brick. Rock to brick. And I think we're going to do the exact same now as well. We'll go another 10 vehicles. And we are not going to do that. We're not going to do that. We're going to sell all them. Go to the... Make sure we click the right line next time, Aiden. Seriously? You can't make these costly mistakes, man, Aiden. And Aiden, don't sell them. What are you? doing man let's go find one there we go all right brand new vehicles coming out of the showroom oh, i don't know why i said the showroom man i don't know why i said the showroom but look how busy it is all our horses and carriages are coming out of the showroom there there we go look at our all of our brand new horses and carriages coming out of the showroom now it'd be cool to see actually if we could make a line going from bowen hills to uh wilston that could be good or to brisbane actually that's even interesting it might be best, though, if we're going to go to Brisbane, we're going to want to set up a, a type of line, right? We're going to need to set up something. I think we need fuel over here, and we can manufacture fuel. Whereabouts can we manufacture fuel? We can manufacture fuel uh, here. There we go. So maybe it might be wiser to Woolungabba. <laughs> Woolungabba. Right. I think I said that right. If I didn't, uh, let me know. But we can set up a transport line that these guys here take fuel and take passengers and deliver them to Brisbane. That could be good to see. All right. Now, how are we doing here now? We've got so many horses and carriages. All right. I'm going to make sure in terms of our lines, we're doing pretty good. I think we're doing really well. In terms of our rock line here, we're going to go to line very quickly. We are going to select this tab here. Going to chuck this one up here. We're going to pin it to here so we can know what we're doing. And we're going to go to our lines. And in terms of frequency, about 17, 23 seconds on the main material line. So that that's, we need material to make product. I think you guys get what I mean. I need material to make products. So in terms of our material to, for, to for, in terms of our material, I should say, is we're doing pretty good, right? Um, frequencies up there, our rates good, our balance, amount of money we're making is not too bad. We're still in the profit zone, which is good to see. Now, in terms of what we should do, is one is picking up. All right, so if we're picking up, let's say 10 seconds. We want to pick it up less than 10 seconds. If it's there, it's there. If it's not, let's go. Just go. That's it. Don't sit and wait. Because the more that these guys have to sit and wait for material, then it's just going to slow the whole line down. Because if one person's waiting two minutes, then the next one will back up to the next one, and then that one will back up, and that one will back up, back up, back up, back up, back up, back up, back up. You guys know what I mean. All right, so that is all okay. We're quite happy on all of this here. 10 seconds there. And the same with this line here. I think three, 10 seconds there and 10 seconds there. You quick, you pick up, you drop off and you go. That's it. No more. You should be able to see it in the background here. Uh, pick up, go. That's it. 10 seconds, you pick up, wait 10 seconds and you're gone straight away. And that should improve our frequency, right? And as you can see, we're about to hit $100,000. We're already over $100,000, $110,000 cash flow. But there we go. That rock line after improving some of those, you know, little bit of detail 
cars. We're now over a hundred thousand dollars there. And in terms of our cash flow, if you look right down the bottom there, it's nearly we're about fifty thousand on. You know, it's a little bit down, but fifty thousand out from two hundred. So that is really well. Now, in terms of our brick to the town now i think this is the crescent or this is north okay i think that's north so in terms of the north pick up and you go that's it honestly that's it you pick up and you go same with this one here with the bread pick up and go so now you'll be able to see 122 seconds three minutes 122 seconds as this start, starts getting into the flow you should start seeing the frequency drop 16 23 seconds like that is really really good if you don't mind me saying that is really really good um we could put more vehicles on that line and we'll still probably do really well i think so that could be an option for us but in terms of this uh these ones here going to the actual town i need to bring that down a little bit more because you know if we're getting if we can get pushing if we can push product to the actual manufacturers really quick that's the main thing that'll be really good but that, check that out 200,000 we did we did just reach 200,000 220 we have a look we're making 418,000 dollars 230 is maintenance interest is 30,000 so we're positive by 230,000 dollars that is at Absolutely awesome. So out of the two lines, we are making money. Super awesome to see. I think that's going to be it for today's episode though, guys. We've got two lines set up. We've got the bread line set up and we've got our brick line set up over here. All making money now over $200,000 in positive cash flow. That is absolutely incredible. If you want to see another episode of Transport Fever 2, make sure you go down below. Smash the like button underneath the subscribe button or on top of the subscribe button. Smash the like button and click the subscribe button down below so you do not miss out on any new videos of Transport Fever 2. But guys, in the next episode, if I have a look, in the next episode I've, I've been doing a lot of planning. Yeah, we're going to be just trying to expand. That's, I mean, honestly, I've, I've got my titles. Like, I'm trying to improve my titles, my thumbnails. Also, comment down below what you think of the thumbnails so far. Um, but yeah, next episode will be actually on Sunday. On Saturday will actually be another Airport CEO video, which is super cool to see. But yeah, we are going to be doing, building so a few more lines. We're already positive cash flow already on the first two lines and i want to start looking at fuel so maybe getting a train in here um delivering fuel or something uh yeah i don't know i just need to run the game now for a little bit now and um hopefully we'll make a bit of money get run the game unlock a few new things so we can do faster and faster transport because hey this is transport fever 2 we've got to be making the best possible line as possible because brisbane in the next episode will probably need our hand because i want to deliver some fuel to them and we're going to look at trains but we need to make sure we're still positive cash flow and we're so we need to make sure we have positive cash flow so we can become the best transport company here in brisbane australia guys if you want to enjoy today's video smash the like on the video if you want to see more videos just like this one make sure you click the subscribe button down here click up here to watch the last video and click down the bottom here to watch the full playlist of our last series farming simulator 22 guys i'll catch you all in saturday's video at 12 a.m australian stand time for another airport ceo series guys with that said have a great rest of your day and i'll catch you then